hello everyone so today i am making this video on unit conversion trick for pressure in this video you will be able to convert every kind of a pressure unit in simple way and in fast way so uh, suppose we have to convert two atm into tor and uh, here 0.69 bar to newton per meter square and 3.6 tor into psi so uh, uh, i am giving you the simplest trick and by using the trick you will be able to solve such kind of uh, numerical problems in few seconds so just remember this series 1 atm 1 bar psi tor and pascal uh, for tor we also use mm hg for pascal we also use newton per meter square so just remember the series i mean firstly one atm comes one bar psi tor and pascal and also these values uh, that is for bar 1.01325 and 14.7 and 760 and 101325 so let's uh, uh, suppose uh, we have to convert one atm to one bar so i mean we are going forward way so one atm to bar so just we know that one atm is equal to 1.01325 bar so secondly now one bar we have to convert one bar into psi so just we know that uh, the value of psi is 14.7 and what we have to do we have to divide it by 14.7 divided by 1.01325 i mean we are moving forward way and in in uh, in forward way we have to divide it like 14.7 divide by 1.01325 and look at here in third example what we have one psi and we have to convert into tor so what we do we know that for tor we have the value 760 and for psi we have the value of 14.7 just simply divide it and we get one psi is equal to 50 uh, 51.71 so for to one tor also uh, we have to convert it into pascal or newton per meter square so we know the value of uh, pascal that is 1.01325 and just simply divided by 760 then we get the value of one tor so moving on to the so like uh, and now we now we are going from pascal to tor and uh, tor to psi and psi to bar and bar to atm so i am taking here one pascal i mean we have to convert one pascal into tor so what we do we just uh, simply divide 760 by 1013 uh, sorry 3 2 5 here 760 divided by 101325 tor so then simply we get this value 0 0.0075 so now we are converting tor into psi so just simply divide it by 760 uh, look at here just just simply divided by 760 then we get the value 0 0.0193 so what we have we have one atm bar psi tor pascal i mean in forward way uh, we are going like this way and in backward way pascal to tor tor to psi and bar and at so like we have uh, uh, one unit conversion i mean 
we have to convert 1 mm hg to atm or uh, 1 mm uh, mm hg uh, to uh, i mean 1 mm hg is also called one tor so uh, we are going from i mean mm hg to uh, atm so we are going backward way so what we have to do we have to just simply divide 1 by 760 so then we get the value 0.001318 atm so here we have the value of 1 tor 0.00131 now we have to convert 2.6 tor into atm from above we know that 1 tor is equal to 0.00131 so just multiplied by 2.6 then we have the value uh, that is 0.00340 so it is just simple so moving on to the next problem now we have 260 so i mean 260 bar and we have to convert it into tor we have bar and we are going bar to tor i mean forward way so what we do uh, firstly we have to calculate for one bar so what we do 7 we divide 760 by 1.01325 and we get 1 bar is equal to 7 uh, 750.06 tor so you know very well after evaluating for one bar just simply multiplied by 260 then we get uh, then we get easily 195015.6 tor here is the third example just do it by yourself and uh, match it and uh, uh, i am giving you three problems related to uh, pressure unit conversion so i hope you like this video and uh, uh, practice more and more so you will be able to convert every kind of pressure unit so at last subscribe the channel for more updates on chemistry tricks so thank you